Hey guys, it's Acorn, and I know you really liked the intro. It was really great, I know, and it's a story time today. I really don't have anything to tell. I'm really bored, and I'm trying to do my homework, but I just thought to do this, because why not? So yeah, let's do it. So it started in PE. Um, no, it actually started in science enrichment in sixth period. We were really doing nothing. We were doing our project, and somebody named Gavin decides to see if his airpods are real now i don't really care because gavin's like pretty cool and i trust him so he takes my airpods out he takes his airpods out and he just replaces them checks them it doesn't really matter i don't care and this idiot literally switches the airpods i'm pretty sure he did it on purpose because his were broken and mine were like brand new and so we're in sign transmen and Oh, I already just said the part, but I don't really care. Um, and he switches them. He switches the AirPods. And I didn't know. I didn't assume he did, obviously, because I didn't want to assume the worst. I mean, we, um, we're in PE. We're just, like, doing nothing. We're having basketball. Basketball is really fun. Um, we're done with that. We leave uh, out of the locker room to listen to music. And I try to turn on my AirPods to connect, and they won't connect. And then I realized, I was like, oh, yeah, these definitely are my AirPods. So I walk out. Some kid takes them, like, for no reason. And then I just, like, punch them and he gives them back. So, yeah, that happened. Um, next, I really just, like... <laughs> so next, I, um, I, like, find Gavin. I find the kid that replaced him because I realized I was, like, having an anxiety attack. And I realized I couldn't find him. And then I found him. Um... Once I find him, I know there's a lot of stuttering in this, I'm sorry, but once I find him, I just, like, talk to him. He's, like, stalling so hard, like, s like stalling for, like, ten minutes. And then he just says, I'm not going to give him back. They're going to work. Don't worry. Like, your AirPods, they're just AirPods. They don't really care. So I was like, okay, if they work, I mean, it doesn't really matter. So then, uh, I mean, I he was, like, trying to convince me that they were his, and, like, even if, it didn't matter. I mean, I knew they were mine, obviously. I just tried to connect them, and they wouldn't work. And when I did, they were messed up. So then, I, like, try to connect them. They don't, I mean, they work, but the bass and everything in the headphone is messed up. So then I, like, decide, like, okay, no, this is not acceptable. So I go to Gavin, and I, like, I, I'm not, I try to find Gavin, one of my friends, Mikey. I try to find him for, like, three minutes. I ask everyone in the gym, and then I finally find him, and then... Okay, so our gym is laid out as there's two exit doorways, and we were on the other side, like, on the corner of the gym. So I'm talking to him, and he somehow manages to stall me and walk across the gym to the exit door while talking to me without me noticing, and just books it and leaves. Okay, so we're talking, he's stalling. Okay, he's trying to convince me that they're his AirPods, and I'm not falling for it, because obviously I know they're my AirPods. Okay. And I know the ones that I used were broke, so I'm obviously not going to do that. Um, and then he opened the door, and I can't leave PE. I can't leave the gym, or else I'll get in trouble. And even if I say he took my AirPods, they'll be like, why didn't you tell us? So I obviously don't say that, because I'm not stupid. Um, next, he, he opens the door, and he leaves. I follow him out a little bit, and I like talk to him for just a little bit, and he just like goes. And I'm just like, okay, I don't care. Actually, no, I think at this time, I didn't even listen to them yet. I didn't know they were broken yet. So, I now is when I listen to them, and I realize they're broken. And this is when I get really heated. I'm, like, triggered at this moment. So now, Mikey, my friend that was with me trying to help me find him, he says, just go tell the teacher. Like, I mean, I know I'm snitching, but they're, like, $160. Like, I don't care if I'm snitching at this point. This is, like, a lot of money. So, I go over and snitch. Okay, he's in the car rider line. And he, like, he gets picked up, like, instantly at the car rider line. So, we go over to the car rider line. The PE coach is like, come over, let's run over there. And I'm supposed to, not supposed to run in hallways, but the PE coach is it. So, we run over there. And when we run over there, we don't really, like, we look in the car rider line everywhere, and he's not there. He's already left. So, when he leaves, we go to the office, which is right next to the car rider line. And... When we're in the office, like, everyone through the window is just staring at me. Like, that kid just snitched. Oh, my God. Like, he, like he's such a snitch. It's like, yeah, obviously I want to snitch. Like, okay. And this moment in the video is really not to know. Um, 
But yeah, obviously I'm not a snitch, so like it's two hundred dollars basically. So I did the snitch, okay. They call him, like they call the phone across the school. He's not there. He's like, his mom picked him up and took him to another school because she's a teacher. Um, and next, I just I was really triggered. We were walking back to the gym, and she was like, "Don't worry, you're gonna get your AirPods back. Like no worries." I'm like, "Okay, yeah, I know. I'm definitely, I'm probably gonna get them back, obviously." And I still haven't gotten back. This happened today, like today. Um, I get back in line. Everyone hears about it. Like everyone knows about it. And I'm just triggered, and then I can't listen to music on the bus, which is literally my favorite part of the day. Um, yeah, there's that noob right here. He's really garbage. Just look at, literally melted. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Um, so we're walking out of the bus, and I'm just thinking to myself, like, I can't believe this. Like, this is so stupid. The lady, the coach, which is actually, like, really cool. She's actually, like, really cool. Um, she asked for my uh, mom's number, my name, and everything. I give it to her, obviously. I obviously gave it to her, as I just said. <clears throat> and then next, what we do is I get back in my line. No, actually, we didn't get back in our line. That was a second ago. Okay, so I get in the bus. Okay, we walk to the bus. No AirPods. I'm triggered. Get in the bus. Once I get in the bus, I'm just like, I told like two of my friends about it. They were like, that's insane. That's stupid. Everyone's texting me. They're like, I can't believe you did that. He's such an idiot. Like, what a dick move. So I'm like, yeah, I know. I agree. And it's really stupid. Um... And then today, which is the next day, actually, um, I'm recording the voice audio. Um, I actually got them back in, like, a big situation or anything. Uh, the coach I was talking about, she just, like, replaced... She didn't replace the AirPods. She got them back, and she switched them. It was really simple. And, yeah, I just, like, got my AirPods back. It was a really simple story. Yeah, story time with Josh, guys. I'm going to end the video. I'm going to end the voice recording here and let the gameplay play out. So, yeah, see you guys.